Hey, hey peeps, good morning, happy Monday, welcome to my week. My goodness gracious me, is it hard to wake up this morning. It is quarter past seven, but obviously still getting used to the clocks having changed last weekend, so it feels like quarter past six. Oh my goodness. I think I went to sleep at quarter past one, actual time. Felt like quarter past 12, I don't even know. Happy Monday, let's do this week. This is what we're working with today, it's gone super comfy and I'm chuffed because that is just what I'm feeling today um, and I'm really happy about it. So I've got, I realised the other day, Sarah was saying, why do you only ever wear the same like three hats when you have hundreds? I was like, I don't know, why do I? So I've got an old one out. This is a Yankees one. It's just got, I don't know if you can see, blue and white and red like little paint specks. I really like it. Then my new friends hoodie. It's got a lot of stuff in the pocket just for me to take downstairs. Then I've got bright red chinos, which I feel like is a bit daring. And last time I wore them to sick form, I felt a bit uncomfortable because they were so bright. But they go really nicely with this little, this little red bit. And I just, they're really comfy. So I'm going to go for it anyway. White braces and then my black Adidas. I'm going to go and see if I can grab something to eat before going to sick form. I have had a fantastic day. And as I'm sure you can tell by the fact I'm squinting and the brightness and the sky behind me. It has turned into an absolutely lovely day weather-wise, so I'm really impressed with that. Summer is officially here. Uh, it was a bit crazy when I woke up this morning, but the day has progressed very nicely. I got a lot of comments on my outfit today. Loads of people liked it, and I actually really liked it as well. Like, I'm really excited for it to be summer now, so I can get out all my bright coloured chinos, because they're just really comfy, and I felt not as like conscious of them as I was when I last wore them. I came home a bit early because I had a free last, and me and Hannah walked back. Although it is now half past three uh, because I have spent the time making sure that the Everest video is uploaded. Check it out if you haven't already. Shameless plug once again. And I've also just left the uh, weekly vlog uploading from last week whilst I walked the dog. And yeah, it's all going pretty well in terms of just everything in life to be perfectly honest. So I hope you are having or have had a good week. Butted my knee. <laughs> right, typically, just so I get my camera out, I started getting hiccups. That was, oh, I was about to say that was so weird. I had like ten when I walked to the other room to get my camera, and then as soon as I started filming, they went. You guys scared them off. What is the time? Let me look at my phone. The only reliable source. It is half past six, and it is so light outside. I am loving this clock change, this whole summer thing. I swear on my heart, I pro. Oh, I promise you guys, this is the last time I'm going to mention it, but please, please, please go and watch... Oh, sorry, the Everest video, if you haven't already, has gone up, well, at five this evening, and my dad's really happy with it, which I'm so glad. No, I'm really happy with it, and I've put absolute hours in. They went in October, and we've been working on it since they've been back. So, if that doesn't give you incentive, then I don't know what will. That's almost like half a year or something. Hey kids, I've just got back from Sainsbury's because I live a fun life and my hair looks like this, you're going to have to deal with it. I've also just proof watched a, uh, the weekly vlog and I realised I didn't put music over a whole section so I'm going to try and change that now. Okay, I'm sorry about this angle and uh, the fact that I'm going to be watching YouTube throughout the duration of this section but what I have planned is, who remembers this bad boy? Oh my god, that is disgustingly dusty. Are you guys even going to be able to tell? I don't think so. That is gross. Yeah, I've recently seen a lot of um, a lot of people posting pictures of smoothies and stuff, and I feel like with the weather, we're getting back into it. So you want to cut your strawberries up into nice sized pieces? I'm going to go with halves or quarters, a mixture, depending on how big the strawberry is. Good morning, guys. Good morning. So I'm going to shove the lid on and turn it on. Are you ready? Oh. Oh. There we go. Oh. It's working! <laughs> Which may be 
raspberries. They all look good. I might just chuck them all in. Blackberries. Actual raspberry flavour. That was insane. My dog just absolutely shot <laughs> off my bed. He's now outside barking. And I swear to God, I just heard bloody pterodactyls. Like that could not be anything but dinosaurs. Hey, 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 boops, good morning. Happy Tuesday. Um, the weather, I don't know what it's like. Ooh, okay, okay, I can work with that. I don't know if you can tell, but the sky is actually blue. Right here, this is the outfit I went for in the end. Got pink bandana, glasses, uh, one of my favourite necklaces, which I don't know if you're going to be able to see, but it's a little gold, um, like circle with a black star on it's really cute i love that uh milan yard because you have to a plain black t-shirt but but hold up a minute what is this is this a round neck yes it is as opposed to my normal v-neck so that's exciting uh, or is it probably not um i've also got my black jumper which was from another outfit and i stole it what a little rebel blue jeans and summary shoes AF. So that is what's happening. If you join us in period one with some more 3D pen experimentation. Oh wow. Oh. Wait, what have we already made? We've made a square, we've made a G for Grace. We made a spiral. Hey, I'll, I'll <laughs> put it. <laughs> I love it. I'm a fashion designer, I knew it. You always knew this was your true profession. Yeah, that and hairdressing. Oh, mm. yeah, I watched your uh, Everest thing yesterday. Good, good. I watched it to Did he? the outside. You idiot. <laughs> I'm just looking at all the pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Sat in silence. Yeah. <laughs> guys please do excuse my appearance and this is still my phone because i haven't charged my camera since i've been home and it died today in art i've had a really good day nothing major to tell you other than i made an exciting decision a fifth period today so we were in philosophy and me and ava were joking around and ava as everyone knows is a vegan and we she was like oh yeah um you're gonna be one yeah and i was like i could never and i was like do you know what YOLO, let's try it. So I've decided for the duration of this vlog, so like not including yesterday or what I ate like this morning, I only decided um, fifth period today in philosophy that until Friday, I'm going to try and be vegan. Just, I think it'll be interesting and try and keep you guys posted. So I've got home. I'm not going to have any of these mini muffins we bought from Sainsbury's because I believe they're not vegan. They've got chocolate chips in, so they know they're not. But I've got my smoothie. I'm going to drink that. And then I'm going to decide what I'm having for tea and start planning that. So, yeah, shout out to Ava for this. I just think it'd be a cool experiment. Cool thing to say that I've tried. Um, interesting to learn a bit more about because I don't know that much about, like, what they can and can't eat and what have you. 
And I don't know, I just think it'd be interesting. Right here, I am back from my dog walk and this is my tea. I explained this situation to my mum and um, yeah, she's willing to help me try and do that. It's basically sausage and mash, but without the best part, the sausages. So it's just like vegetables and stuff. And yeah, okay, it may, like, I know that if you're gonna properly go vegan, you probably need to spend like, you know, a good few weeks phasing stuff out and you don't just do it as bluntly as I'm doing it. However, this is just a short, like, trial period. I'm not actually planning on making this life change. Um, I mean, I might by the end of it, who knows? I don't really know, but this is just something that I thought would be interesting to try. Don't be hating on me if I have had something that technically isn't vegan. I don't know, I'm gonna be trying my best to check packaging and things like that and just give it a go. And I recommend you guys do too, just because I think it's a cool thing to be able to say. So that's what's happening here. I'm like in the small sausages and it's making me sad. First of all, I'm aware this weekly vlog is gonna be so flipping long because I know I have so many fun things coming up, but that is the way I like it. So I'm certainly not complaining. I hope you guys are all right with that. Seeing as I seem to be incredibly inspired by my friends right now, as you saw earlier, Sara was practicing for her grade six piano exam, I think. And she let me sit in there while she's practicing and it was absolutely amazing. And I've decided, seeing as I do have a keyboard and I'm awful at it, <coughs> but I'm gonna try my best this evening to learn something new. I can also play this. <laughs> oh, jokes. Right, catch up within a bit. I have practiced this once or twice before. Oh, don't you go back, just keep your eyes on me. I said, you're holding back. She said, shut up and dance with me. This woman is my said what did she say <laughs> Ooh, dance with me. next thing i'm going to work on which i spent hours working on before um probably about a year ago and has barely played since i don't play on my keyboard very much because i'm not that good at it but that's the point is that i'm going to try and get better obviously i'm not going to be sara standards but if you want good music, then I will uh, try and get some more filmed of her. Good morning, happy Wednesday. I'm running so late, I've just got up and it's quarter to eight. And I normally leave at about five to eight, but luckily I planned my outfit yesterday, so it's all good. We have black cat, grey hoodie with a like blue penguin shirt over the top, grey jeans, and my docks. That's what we're working with today. I'm gonna grab all this and head off to sick form. Progress, just need to uh, stick that down, do a background, and then I'm gonna like make loads of weird stuff like little dodgy spongebob over here hi guys yeah that is fixing the hair that i tried doing with my awful nails excuse them i did the top half and then she did the bottom half thank you taya hey peeps laura's here for work out of wednesday i used to like a little head i'm on the floor with the doggy did you have a good day laura oh, oh i just clocked him in the head i'm so sorry just he might have a tick as well i think yeah laura did you have a good day I just put on the group chat you hit your dog and I did have a good day, just very, very tired. Oh, I don't think I updated you, but last night I really wanted garlic bread. And um oh, sorry, someone I on Snapchat just put on two baguettes of garlic bread. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I like but, garlic bread though, can you? Yeah, it's not vegan and we have white bread, which isn't vegan either. So I looked in the freezer, we had bread rolls, which are vegan, so I made them and then I crushed garlic and put it on and made my own garlic bread last night. It was really nice. And then today I had a smooth breakfast on the way to school and then I made Laura and Rebecca traipse round co-op with me to find Pringles and I also got some like sweets and my favourite 
pink drink. Me and Laura were talking about this program earlier, which actually came out in 2013, which is bloody ages ago. That's four years. Good maths. And um, it's called, I'm sure a lot of you have heard of it, possibly watched it, My Mad Fat Diary. But we used to be obsessed with it. We watched it every single week and we'd discuss it to him from school. And it's just a really good program. I'd recommend it if you want to get into something. There's three seasons of it and it's all on all four. But I think I'm going to try and re-watch it. Um, I might watch another episode of My Mad Fat Diary. It's really good. I forgot how, like, one, how, like, deep it is and, like, I can't really explain. If you know what it's about, you'll get what I mean. <laughs> it's so deep. And it's also so sexual. <laughs> so if you're going to watch it, I'm pretty sure it's an 18. Then just be aware of that. Hey, 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 peeps. Good morning. Happy Thursday. Welcome to my day. I am looking forward to oh, the day. Um, although Hannah is ill. Oh, I found my hairspray. Out for the day. Got this polo t-shirt, which I actually bought when I was in New York. And I really like it. And then I just never wore it. It's one of those things. You know when you make like a rediscovery? Because it got put in my drawers and I never look for t-shirts in my drawers. These like blue jeans that have like pockets and stuff. And then I'm probably going to, probably gonna put on my um, black Adidas. All the teachers come. First period. And second we have a free as well because Mr. Mulvaney isn't in. But we've just been watching um, a load of weird videos including, wait, what's the other one called? How English people sound to non-English speakers. I think. Yeah, something like that, which you should go and watch because it's so trippy. Like, how do you explain it? I guess the title sums it up. Yeah, <laughs> So like, when you listen to another language, people talking, and like it sounds like weird, like, but you, you feel like you should understand, understand, it. understand it, but you can't because they they've got an English accent, <laughs> and they're speaking English words. It's just you just can't understand it. What was the thing guy said? Hey, ma. Uh, how you do? Oh, yeah. Hey Ma, how you do? <laughs> I'm gonna that stop. Was that's, that's not in that video, by the way. That's, that's not English. English. But now hey, watching Ma, the most doing? unsatisfying video ever, and I'm gonna Disgusting. try and film the reaction. Where are we? We're at 2:42. Oh no. I tell. Yeah. <laughs> it never works. Let's be real. It's really <laughs> awkward. <laughs> <laughs> that way <laughs> also i'm sure a lot of you have already seen this because it's actually in alfie's vlog which is where i've got the idea from but it just oh. really made me laugh and i knew you would hate it so i thought you were being unique here <laughs> this one <laughs> me with everything <laughs> your life oh stencils never ever work they just never do oh no hang on a second what is that <laughs> that was fine <laughs> Do you not see what kind of animal they just created? Is that a cat? Look, they moved it. Wait. I'm really close. Wait. To the camera. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Some like neck bulge. <laughs> oh goodness! It's very crumbly. I guess it's quite gross. Mm. That's mm. Just a bit Oh, I know what's gonna happen. No. Oh, wait. Oh, the picture's not really. Well, that is. Ha oh. Okay. No, 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 no! I can't. I can't. <laughs> That's the line. <laughs> That's hungry. So I just fell out my mouth. <laughs> oh God! There could be a shivers. <laughs> what are we doing, Grace? Explain. Today, I'm creating another one of my art pieces. Outside. Outside. To get all elements Al of nature. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> In this corner. You ready? Yep. Yeah. Oh. Seconds after saying I want to keep these clothes paint free. <laughs> we moved over here. <laughs> Grace has got, got wood in it. It fell over twice and then once on, on to the Right. Yeah. I had to go on the floor. <laughs> Gutted. Hey, I've had a good day and after school I stayed in the library for a bit with Alex and Olivia and Zach. And I did a load of sociology, which was very productive. Came home and, not gonna lie to you, oh, just threw that myself. I wasn't in 100% best mood. 
don't really know why. I think I'm, oh, I was just really, really hungry and I'm struggling to find things in my house I can eat on my vegan diet at the moment. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you, I am struggling a little bit with it. But Robert has just popped round and it was actually really nice to see him. Like, I don't know, it's really nice sort of end to my day um, to get to catch up with him for a bit because I don't see him that often because he doesn't go to my sixth form. 